guys. So I am on an airplane <laughs> with Jim. <laughs> Uh, this is why you can tell we never fly in nice classes. Um, we are on our way to uh, New York, uh, specifically Long Island. We've got a gig to do. I'm excited. Um, I'm excited to sleep, to be honest. Just things have been really intense. So the fact that I'm allowed now to have six hours of sleeping, amazing. <laughs> We're in like, this is why they don't put us in the nice people places. This is why it's not a nice thing. We have too much for mess about. But anyway, it's gonna be really fun. It's a private gig, so I've had a lot of people ask me like, oh, I want to come see you when you're in America, and I'm like, mm, sorry, it's kind of a private gig. Um, but I can take you along for some of it. So. Let it go. Bye. <laughs> Right, we landed, we are here, yay! We're on a wee walk at the minute, uh, we're going to go get some food. Just, I got to the hotel room, called my mummy, had a shower, and we're here. Mommy. I had to call mummy, like, mommy. you know, I have to do it. Um, it's freaking roasting, but I'm used to it, like, because London's been this warm and I love it. Only downside is, they have air con over here, right? So when you go outside, you have to wear people clothes. Whereas London, you just wear nothing because nowhere's got aircon. Whereas here, if you wear nothing and you go sit inside for five minutes, you're freezing. Like I got in a car earlier and I was like, I don't know how to say that I've got goosebumps all over my body. That was very cold. It was very oh, cold. Thank God it wasn't just me. I didn't want to say anything. That was really cold. So this is what happens when British people go to America. We just never say that we're like too cold or too anything. It's just, so I'll suffer in silence. Day <laughs> walking's legal by the way. Didn't know Whoopsie. that. Whoops. But Whoopsie. then because nobody walks over here, they don't have as many crossings as we do. So yeah, did I just run across the street and almost die? Yeah. Will it be worth it for food? Yeah. Burger and fries. Burger and fries. Burger and fries. What you doing there, Jim? Killing myself. <laughs> Look at it, look how shiny it is. I've never seen bums this fast looking. I'm gonna bring you guys a Thank you. She knows me too well, she knows I eat with my face. <laughs> Alright, whoa. That is quite. Not what is that? It's good there. Janet, give it, give it a review. 11 out of 10. Yo, random segment within this vlog that nobody asked for, but I'm giving. Uh, I am an absolute. Uh, fanatic of cold brew um, I could live on the stuff it is my favorite thing okay it's 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 my luxury it's my biggest spend cold brew and fizzy water is my kryptonite because obviously I don't drink or do anything like that so like I gotta amuse myself somehow right cold brew coffee is my is my jam uh, so we have this brand here in the UK anyway this is cold brew by uh, I say Khalifa, I know that's probably not how you pronounce it, but we already have this in the UK, and by the way, it's amazing. Not sponsored or anything like that, but it is lovely. I love it, I think it's great. What we don't have in the UK, and what I'm going to talk about right now that got me very excited, excited enough to take my camera out and film, was this. What is this? It's almost a litre and a half of cold brew coffee by Starbucks. Again, not sponsored, and I know people are gonna slate me for being white, like the way I am. But <laughs> it's Christmas for me, um, so I'm gonna pour myself a glass of these, and uh, I'll keep you updated and let you see see what see what they taste like. Oh, it's like it's like a Janet Joplin wet dream. All right, world's quickest taste test. Uh, I'm gonna take a little swig of the Khalifa because I've already had it before. Uh, it's it's cheating though because it gets it gets to have like milky stuff in it. It's obviously almond milk, but yeah, it's just an act of the gods. It just it's like it's 
like chocolate milk, but you know you're going to get caffeinated as heck after it. You know what I mean? That kind of vibe. Definitely a fan. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. If anyone's, like, because I get a lot of people asking, oh, I want to get into cold brew, but it's all very strong. Try this stuff. You're short it. It's just amazing. It's just so sweet and gorgeous. Oh, my God. Because it's a mocha, like. All right, let's try the Starbucks one. I've already opened it, so let's pour it. But it's strong, though, Khalifa. That's what I like about it. You can still taste the coffee. Okay. This is a teeny, teeny, tiny butt. Okay, it's a long close. Whatever. All right. This is the cold brew by Starbucks, but it's the blonde roast unsweetened. Um... It didn't look to be the strongest. It's mellow and soft, but like, we'll see. Okay. Wait. It doesn't smell very strong. Because normally, when I smell cold brew, sometimes it smells like whiskey. I'm like, oh, it's heavy. All right, let's go. Hmm. Yeah, that's kind of just like water, actually. Do you know what this is? This actually reminds me of, um, when you get to the bottom of like your really, really like your nitro uh, cold brew, the really strong one, and you just like leave loads of ice and then you just drink the icy water. This is icy water. This is what happens when you don't drink and you're an adult. Yeah. I'm doing that incredibly risky thing of taking your phone in the water. <laughs> Don't do it, it's not a good idea. Um, decided to come down for a little swim, uh, which I can't really do because it's only four foot six. So it's definitely more of a chill out pool. But I'm a water baby, so I'm enjoying it. Um, Jim was supposed to join me like 20 minutes ago, he's not, so I've been entertaining myself. Apparently you're not supposed to swim alone. S sorry, oops. All right, yeah, I'm gonna keep on chilling out for a little bit. Dangerous. <laughs> I'm in a swimsuit, not really. I kept the bottoms away. Ah, water. I've been in it. It was great. Jim's over there having a beer. I'm not going to film him because that's impolite because he's wearing no top and he said don't. <laughs> so I've died and gone to heaven. The sun's out as well. Alright, so we did the gig yesterday. It went really well. I obviously wanted to respect the privacy of everyone involved by not filming. Um, but it went really well. It was really good. Uh, everybody was really lovely. As Per usual when you go to America they're all so friendly and nice. Um, Jim gig review. It was really great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah it was it was awesome. Um, uh, well that's me I gotta turn my phone off. Okay well I'll see you sometime good morning guys it is 5 a.m i am at stansted airport uh, i was up at three to be here on time uh i'm on my way to denmark actually uh, i've never been to denmark i've flown in and driven out uh to sweden but uh, it's my first time actually going i've got a gig i'm very excited about uh i'm just about over my jet lag from america because it's always like short trips that really take it out of me um so I just got over it and now I'm going to jump another time zone and being awake at 3 a.m. to fly. I am very tired. Also, I uh, lost my charger, so I had to pick one up in the airport. I'm in the space age. Look at me go with this thing. Woo! Wireless thingy. 
I'm excited. All right. Uh, I'll see you um, when I film next on this trip. We went the wrong way. We went the wrong way. So now uh, we are on a bus to go back because it's a one way system in Stansted. Um, <laughs> Sorry, Denmark, if I missed my flight. <laughs> so just landed in Denmark. Uh, and uh, you know, just oh god, it's just gotta go in this thing. Ugh, Ugh how horrible is that? <laughs> Joking, how cool is that? <laughs> Jim? No way, what's going on? <laughs> First, we fly club class. Club class, now we're in a limo. Okay, so we're just driving through, and I'll insert footage here of Billboard. Beep. Uh, <laughs> hey, it's my face, it's been on a billboard in Denmark. Nice to see you too. Uh, we are very near where we're staying. Uh, also, there's a medieval festival going on, I learned. Uh, uh, which means there's horses, which means um, high probability of me being there. Uh, also, the hotel has bikes. So, will I cycle my bike to go see some horses? Probable. Very probable. If I don't fall asleep. Because uh, I am really hungry, so I'm thinking I'm going to eat myself into a food coma and see what happens and then go to the wellness room which we still don't know what a wellness room is Jim wellness room who <laughs> knows not even Google knew what a wellness room is yeah it was like could be multiple things it means different things to different people so we shall see I'm excited <laughs> also I know I look like death I look like a shoe shoe for reference that's a shoe oh my god it's identical ah. <laughs> oh no the car smells it does smell like <laughs> Jim we're in the wellness room stop laughing we're supposed to be relaxed <laughs> don't bat damn bat <laughs> don't bat <laughs> oh that really tickled <sighs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for the, the images though. <laughs> it is lovely though, look at it. Hell yeah. So we decided to take the bikes out. <sighs> we accidentally ended up at the Medieval Festival, which is across the street. I'm starving though. I need food. Like, no. Also, I'm very out of shape, so. <sighs> Can you hear that? a sign of me not working out ever. Do you want to try the festival? We might get some meat on a stick. Yeah. <laughs> After a quick wee walk around here, I genuinely have no idea what is going on. But oh my god, look at that doggo. Uh, I don't think we had dogs like that in medieval times. If I knew this was going to happen, I would have brought my actual camera, but... I'm absolutely amused by this whole thing. It's just lots of people just casually hanging out in medieval dress, I think, is my favourite. I don't know how we've ended up here. One minute we're in a limo, and the next minute we're at a medieval festival. By accident. Get him, Jen! So, I just got into the hotel room now. It's about 3 in the afternoon. Had a lovely cycle, it was awesome. Uh, let's. Let's do a hotel room tour because this was pretty cool. So I'm gonna show you the bathroom first because it's mental. Hey, <laughs> it's a pretty, pretty big bathroom, am I right? Like the old shower bath, the whole shebang. All right, beep beep, come out. Hey, <laughs> and then come in here to this. Hell yeah. Oh, I've got a bathrobe and everything. I'm, I'm only saying this now, I'm saying this with you. Um, oh, dang. Oh, yeah. Love to be a free pair of sandals. Probably have to, probably don't get to keep them. But still, same applies. Uh, oh, there's a balcony, guys. There's a balcony. I don't know if that's how you open it, but I'll try. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god, yes.
All right, that's pretty cool. I'm, I'm done, I'm game. I can get on board. Monster. <laughs> that's a monster burger. It's a grand burger. It's your nan burger. It is like a grand burger. <laughs> it's your ma burger. sound check uh all good uh, it's always so funny uh, i have the same conversation with every sound engineer like can we just have like a lot less of me and a lot less and a lot less and a lot <laughs> my pitching i can't i can't pitch when i can hear my voice for some reason it's like i get really like afraid of it so then i don't sing as loud and my pitching goes um which is obviously not a good idea for a show so that was sorry i'm on like two percent um Jim's playing a grand piano. Grand piano. Um, grand piano. I'm about to post it on the internet for someone else to see. Hell yeah. It sounds really nice as well. And like the actual theatre itself is absolutely beautiful. Um, so we're excited. We're going to have a wee wander around town, I think, now. Um, because a wander around town. Wander around. There's <laughs> a lot of Northern Irish in that sentence. <laughs> yeah. We're going to do that. Um, might get a coffee or something. I'm excited. I still haven't eaten yet, so I'm a bit, I'm a bit Hank Marvin, you know what I mean? <laughs> Alright, let's go. So it's uh, four o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, it's a Saturday. And everywhere's shut. And as you can tell, there's not, there's not a lot of people about, actually. Everyone. <laughs> it feels a little bit post-apocalyptic. So I can hear sirens in the background. <laughs> But maybe this is something we don't know, because we're tourists. That's weird, that's a bit weird as well. Yeah, that's a bit bonkers. What's that? It's a mother's dog eating a baby. He's like, I'm uh, gonna eat you in a second. <laughs> Just pet it. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna go get some. I want coffee. That's what I want, slash need, slash both. It's not long till dinner, but uh. <laughs> I'm drinking my calories. I'm gonna crash so hard. <laughs> it's just full of sugar. It tastes great, by the way. Here's what I Well, it's Jim right out the set list today. Thanks, Jim. Everything just looks normal, you know. There's there's a set list there, you know. All fine, all good. Janet's, um, DeMonte's, things we couldn't find. Who's the kids? Zomba, Zomba Womp. Right, wicked gum. Yeah. What is whis whiskey? What? Whiskey. I couldn't think of one for that. Just put bull 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 eyes. Eyes. lullaby. Icy, icy fire. Yeah. Uh, love was there is a new one. <laughs> Ouch. What hurt? Oh, okay, that's what hurt the most. Okay, numb bum. Wow. Living on eclairs. Thanks. Gotta keep it interesting, haven't you? Yeah, nice. you're making my job on stage really easy. <laughs> also, I look like I put my finger in a plug socket. Hey! <laughs> is over um what an awesome show what an amazing experience to see so many familiar faces joined with new faces in a very unfamiliar country um so nice to say hello to everybody at the end and get hugs and find out where everybody came from a lot of traveling for some people uh, which is mental i can't believe they like, came all the way here to watch the show very nice though very very nice so yeah i'm gonna chill out now, I think take the face off, uh, relax 
I nabbed a few Diet Cokes before I left, so I'm gonna have them. And yeah, chill the rest of my night out. All by myself. Don't wanna be all by myself. Good morning, guys. Um, I got in last night uh, to London, uh, to my house, about 2.30, 3am. Uh, I left um, Denmark, I left my hotel room at 10am, um, so that was a trip, which was 9am UK time, so what a day. <laughs> I was stuck in the airport from 11am until like midnight, uh, our flight just was delayed. But I also, um, I wanted to get work done during the day and I just realised how bad of an idea that was. Uh, I should have just like hung out and had fun but I decided no, I'm going to go to the airport and do my emails and things. So that's why I didn't vlog because um, I wanted to get work done. But there's only so much work you can do in the airport and only so long you can sit on an uncomfortable chair before you want to cry. And I couldn't check in my big bag because I had a suitcase with me. Um, so I couldn't check in until like eight o'clock at night and I got there at 11 so I had to wait out the whole day there um so look at these look at these eye bags mum I am a little bit ruined to be honest um and yeah the flight was delayed great loved it it was a joke someone was like oh I'll laugh if your flight gets delayed and I did laugh you know when you're just like so beyond done that you're just like ha 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 of course it's delayed it was one of those but anyway quick round up love Denmark people were lovely everybody was lovely thank you so much to everybody who traveled some people came from America some people came from all over Europe uh to come to the show um it was insane I loved every minute of it it was such a nice sweet trip for me um so I'm gonna go now because I've got today off it's bank holiday Monday here in the UK and I'm a little bit broken from jumping from America time to uh UK time to to D Danish time so I'm gonna go like sleep and stuff <laughs> all right thank you so much for watching and I hope you're having a happy happy day okay bye <laughs>